<coughs> Lady Death, welcome, welcome. I hope you're doing well on this fine ass. You weren't in there. Oh, no. Oh, God, dude. Of course, like, I, um... I'm I'm banned for one day, and uh, that happens. That's crazy. But <coughs> I'm good. I'm good. We got coffee in us. Um, we're gonna go over a couple documents that I found yesterday. That uh, just gonna go through them and talk about how. So these we're gonna go through some tickets from my previous uh, reports. This was two years ago. I got mass reported for my name, and they made me change my name. So I just put an umlaut in my name. Um, so I when when I first started streaming on Fartsmella, <coughs> two weeks, two week ban for advertising, two week ban for advertising, Lady Death. So anyway, I am uh three years ago, I was in a guild, and we were raiding. It was uh we were getting ready for TBC. Anyway. I quit that guild and I started my own guild. And then my guild, I would, uh, there was a, a gold seller and a booster that I would warn people about because they were bad. They would die. Um, I paid them for like five runs in a row. They died on the first one, logged out. They paid, they paid me back those runs. But then when they were paying me back those runs, a pair of edgies drops and I'm playing with my homie and the homie gets the edgies. And usually the etiquette in a, uh, in a Mara boost is if you get the edgies, you get to fucking keep them. It's fucking free for all loot. If you're a smart fucking booster, you're going to put it on uh, epic loot is rolled off still, or it's a master loot kind of shit. <coughs> anyway, that person rips me off. So I, my advertisements when I first started streaming were heart smell 509. Don't trust 15 gold, 30 minute Mara runs uh, by Maji. Anyway, those guys mass reported me and got me silenced. I got that silence removed. This is our current silence right now. No, no, no. This is not our current silence. It's three years ago. Three years ago, okay? So, um, so please let me know. What about my chat is abusive? And I will stop doing it. But you have never once told me what is wrong with my chat. Just keep silencing me when I have won appeals before in the past about my Twitch. And have been told on three separate occasions, it is fine. Please fix your bots that keep silencing me or contact me as a real person. And let me know what is against TOS ASAP. Because this ruins my stream pretty hard. And, 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 and you know, it, I, I advertise my stream, dude. I've been doing it for three years. And if I'm not getting punished daily for it, it's not a fucking punishment. And it's not against their TOS. So I, I, I want to make a video of this. So we're going to highlight this section. And I'm going to I'm gonna edit it. And I want to blast this video. Because either they're saying it's against the rules to fucking advertise your Twitch. Which I have proof of them saying it's not against the fucking rules. Or they're saying that... Farts are inappropriate and, like, a vulgar language when you can slash fart on players in the game. So, anyway. Uh, this is how I responded. Following a review of your case, we can confirm that the evidence presented was correct and that the sub subsequent action taken was appropriate. Our decision in this matter will stand, will not be overturned. For privacy and security reason, it is our policy never to reveal details regarding account investigations beyond those which are provided in the original notice mail. There was nothing provided in the original notice mail, guys. Like, I, I mean, like, there was nothing. It said that you were banned for abusive chat. Chat. I have not been informed once of what my abusive chat was. This is three years ago, too. So, um, blah, 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 blah. This is, uh, this is where our fucking, uh, our rules can be found. This is our in-game policies, which I've gone over, and we will go over and read all of the things that, that my ban could pertain to, right? So, I advertise in general. I advertise in general, chat dog. It's general. And, like, that's, like, I advertise in general. And I advertise in, um, uh, and I don't advertise in looking for group. I advertise in general. That is fucking it. And I don't even spam it that often. So, I would really like to talk to a human about why I'm getting silenced, not just getting a bot response over and over and over again. 
I have been customer for so long. Please contact me with a real human, not just basic responses, not telling me what I'm doing, what I've done wrong. You guys refuse to tell me what I've done wrong in any of the communications on WoW. You just say that the stream is fine, but other things are bad. That doesn't make sense. I will continue to advertise my stream in game. Please just tell me what I am doing wrong and I will stop. Literal, literally just asking them to tell me what behavior must I change? I mean, I'm not saying that it's the only thing, but once you have a couple of viewers that are watching your channel, no matter what, right, you're going to catch people every once in a while. And I'm not saying that it's like the best way to catch viewers, but if I didn't advertise, I wouldn't know Ritzy. I wouldn't know. I, I think I met you through an advertisement. Um, so these things happen because we are choosing to do stuff. We are choosing, to, and, and now that I know you stream, I'll hit you with a follow. Uh, everybody go check out uh, at Lady Death. They're very kind. They've been very kind in every chat that they've joined today uh, since they've started. Um, we're in the same guild? Okay. Wait, which one? Was it One Lifers? By advertising guilds, too. So once again, I've, I've been silenced four times in the last week. Kind of ridiculous. This penalty has already been upheld. Any further requests on this topic will not be reviewed. So like, they're just ignoring me. They're just ignoring me. I'm literally like, like none of this is unreasonable, right? To ask why I'm getting banned. I really, that's just not unreasonable at all. It, it, it's, oh, Blaze Goats. Hell yeah, Lady Death. That's what's up. Well, I guess you could say. And then I say, so I have been suspended for verbal abuse, saying nothing of an abusive nature. This tribunal style silence system you have is kind of ridiculous to just bot silence people. This is three years ago. Oh, yeah, we did talk yesterday. Well, welcome, welcome, Fine Apple. Yeah, I remember now you were you popped in while we were doing the, uh, the RFC. OK, cool. All right, all right, all right. So this is the beginning of my silences still being upheld. So, so I was reported for abusive chat, but I do not ever say anything inappropriate. I'm being targeted for my stream. I hope you're doing well. After checking everything out on the silent, now the silence has been upheld on your account. Whilst advertising your personal Twitch channel may be okay, drug references or not. This is the first reference we have from them saying advertising your personal Twitch is okay. My old tag used to be bong hits and bangers. That was what I used to, I used to say. Fart smell of 509 slash Twitch. Bong hits and bangers, dude. That's what we did. That was our old advertisement. And I can understand that. Why don't I did? I stopped saying bong hits. I stopped saying bong hits. Even though it's like marijuana is legal in my state. I hear people talking about alcohol all the fucking time, dude. So is it against is it against TOS to talk about alcohol now? So like what the fuck are we even talking about? Like what am I doing wrong? It is all I've been trying to find out since I first started getting banned. So this is a smaller version of that. Just catching the that they say while it's advertising your personal Twitch channel may be okay. The drugs are not. And this is for, this is for wow, this one, one of these. All right. And this is from their, this is from their community guidelines. Well, <coughs> while we encourage you to report players that are behaving in a disrespectful manner, falsely reporting another player with sole intent of restricting their gameplay is also unacceptable and will result in penalties to your account. I am getting reported for verbal abuse. What about fart around and find out is verbal abuse? What about fart smell of 509 and saying, oh no, my feelings is verbal abuse? I'm really trying to find that. Guild I'm in with my other tunes was banned for our Alliance Guild on Grobulus because of the name. They had to change it. They made me change my name and I just put an umlaut over the A in it. And they made me change my whole account name, like even though this is my fucking stream account. So... Communication. When participating in communication of any kind, chat, voice communication, group finder, you are responsible for how you express yourself. You may not use language that could be offensive or vulgar to others. So if, if, if farts are offensive or vulgar to others, why can I walk up and slash fart on players? This is my thing. Hate speech and discriminatory language is inappropriate, as in any, obs 
as is any obscene or disruptive language threatening or harassing another player is always unacceptable. Like the only thing that I feel like they have any grounds on is disruptive language. But once again, we're talking about language and code that is in the game. I can walk up and slash fart on you, dog. I can walk up and slash fart on you and I brush up against your character, fart and smell you and say you stink. So are we just gonna, like, am I trying to get fart taken out of the game now? Kush coma. Wait, Kush, that's a great name. That's a great name. What's wrong with that? And here's, here's, the, here's the ban from yesterday, guys. So I did a deep dive in my emails and found every ticket and went through every ticket I've ever filed with Blizzard. To find these examples that I've given to you guys, and and then I've I've shared these uh, these screen caps with Blizzard now. Um, this is a quote of what I was typing when I got banned. It's dumb you can't slash fit. It's dumb that 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 that, that I get mass reported, so they don't want to take the time to look at my chat logs and see that I have no abusive chat. Like it's not like it's hard to look at somebody's chat logs, right? Like, I, I don't even fucking cuss in this game, really. Like, like League of Legends has taught me not to curse because you can get banned in League for just saying curse words. Like, so... So it's like, okay, this is why I got banned yesterday. I posted my link. It's not even a link. Just a direction. You have to, you can't click on it. You have to go out of your way to come to my website. So I got two-week banned for this. I haven't been warned for at least three days, which... During those three days, guess what I was doing constantly? Advertising at least 10 times a day. Um, I had figured I had changed my behavior since the last time I had been warned. I'm not getting reported. I'm not getting any uh, any account warnings, right? So I can assume that my behavior changed in a way that advertising my stream is acceptable and that whatever I was getting reported for was not because I accidentally shared it in looking for groups. The last time I got... A report, which I'm fine with that. I do not. I did not mean to share it looking for group that time. Um, I have also in the past been informed on Overwatch and World of Warcraft that advertisements are okay as long as they aren't links and that I do not advertise illegal substances. Just looking for clarification and why such a harsh penalty for no verbal abuse or harm to anyone when I ignore when the ignore button exists. Haven't had any trouble in almost a year. So it's been like eight, nine months since I've I've been banned or silenced at all. That's probably the biggest thing is it's been nine months since I've been suspended or silenced and I just got a 14 day suspension. Uh, this action has been taken in accordance with the terms of use and our in-game policies and uh, which all players acknowledge and agree to prior. See, OK, let's look at these other. Look, so let's look at every single one of these other tickets. There's a name here. Zyrix. Okay. Look, Mark Conford. This is a, they removed my silence this time. Look, Frost Fennec. We got, we got multiple people here. Crastilius and, and Afraid and R. Um, look, this one where we actually get the silence upheld again. Um, Bear to know. Look, they even fucking spelled, like, look, okay, they call me fucking Alan, dog. My name is right there, and it's in the ticket prior. Like, my name's right fucking there. They call me fucking Alan, dog. Um, but let's look at this. Huh. Huh. It's weird. Why is there no fucking... I'm not Alan anymore, but greetings, no one. Blizzard, support. This is bullshit. So anyway, they up here, they uphold the actions on my account. They uphold the actions. No, don't call me Alan. I mean, I guess you can call me Alan if you want. Um, or at least there's a funny con uh, context to it, right? Um... So I go and read the shit out of their, their services, and I'm like, okay, cool. And I'm like, where did I mess up? Like, I really just want to know what I am doing 
that is against your TOS. Please just tell me what the fuck I'm doing wrong so that I can change it. Like, like we have, we have, we have established with multiple GMs on multiple support tickets a year in between that advertising's fine. Like we, we have established this. I had a battle net once with the name Rain Blow Me. <laughs> it's just people being salty, dog. Uh, Kumatori, hope you're doing well, dog. I've been stopping in on your uh on your uh your streams lately and just kind of lurking them. What you were watching that Hindenburg video the other day. That was pretty good shit. I don't I just didn't get why the dude was in a was in a he was in a fucking uh an apron while he's talking about the Hindenburg. It was kind of an interesting video, but we're rocking a kind of a, an egregious complaint video about like I got banned for two weeks from uh, WoW yesterday for uh advertising my stream is all I did, and I didn't even really communicate at all in chat other than that. Um, so then we move on to them responding and saying, "Oh, we're gonna uphold the action you've uh, like violated." Like things, dog. Like, um, wait. But I read through the entire communications guidelines, and none of my communications have been vulgar or violent. I have been in uh, previous tickets, been told that my advertisement is fine. So, can we please at least address what about my communications have been inappropriate, and I can change it? But there has been no communication to me about the problems with my speech. I am just being mass reported for sharing my stream. When I go four days advertising upwards of 10 times a day, I do not receive any warnings or notices of my behavior. And then I am hit with a two week ban out of nowhere for verbal abuse. Uh, when I have said not, I have said no hate speech or vulgar communications unless you are saying that farts are vulgar and inappropriate. And it is an. It is an emo in your game to slash fart. It also says in the ban that this was thoroughly investigated and that can't be true when this is easily just me being banned uh, from mass reports because I advertised in Baron's general chat. So please explain what I have done so I can change behavior, not just ban me and explain nothing just to allow me to be banned for the same reason, right? I feel like I'm being very cordial. I haven't said a single curse word. I haven't talked shit about their game. I haven't done anything. So at this point, when they denied my thing, I'm like, fuck this, dude. We're going on a deep dive. I go into my email. I fucking type in Blizzard Entertainment. Uh, and I type in ticket. Because each one has a, has a ticket number with it. And so every every report that I've ever filed pops up in my email. I go to the fucking first one and we're like reading everything and I'm taking screen caps of every time they've told me you can advertise, you can advertise, don't talk about bongs, um, don't be mean, don't verbally abuse people. And I'm like, and I'm not saying I haven't called people some, some, some fucking uh, some questionable things. And I'm going to say that, 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 that the, the fucking bands that I did have were in Overwatch for talking shit. So there were there was one that was justified. Also, I found my ticket from three years ago saying my advertisement is not against the TOS. And I changed my behavior after finding out why I was banned. So if the stream isn't the reason I got banned, I can only presume that farts are against TOS. I am referencing ticket ID this and then also referencing being repealed on ticket number this. And, and they're both the exact same thing. So then I attached both files to the ticket. This is where we're at as of now. I haven't gotten any response from Blizzard today. Um, there's a possibility that they just fucking ignore it. Because after the first ticket is uh, is filled out, they can just ignore any further tickets. This ticket has not been considered resolved. As I read the email from the ban, it says, uh, click here to review and resolve your ticket. If you continue to experience issues, you can respond to your ticket with additional information. No, if you can't log into your account, respond. To your ticket, you'll need to submit a new ticket. If you do not resolve the ticket or provide an additional response within one week, we will resolve the ticket automatically and you'll receive a final update via email. So, like, what, they respond? They responded to my first ticket at 5.37. So I'm expecting probably a response today around 5 So. And I'm so happy I just entirely abandoned anything made by Blizzard companies. Dude, they are so dumb. 
But like that's the thing is that I love I I did my last thing for Classic WoW, I guess. I did my 60 hardcore journey. I got to 60 on my road. That's dope as fuck. That's what the goal was. But this 0.5 grind is cool as shit, but my fucking uh my my healer friend died today, I guess. Oh no, guys. Oh no, guys. Dude, I'm so sorry. Dude, that feels so bad that the homie died. No. Yeah, um, I, you know, honestly, this is probably the last straw. Blizz chips, dude. Dude, rips for the rip, dude. I'm so sorry. It's because I wasn't there. There. It's because I wasn't there to vanish, fucking cheap shot the mob on you. Because why would a rogue ever? Oh, you got your white mate. Ooh, maybe I should... Ugh, I should just kill my character. I should just kill my character and we can go around and, and PvP. Go do world PvP. Like, take your character to, like, contested areas. And then get you ganked on. And I'm just hiding in the background ready to kill people when they go on you. So, this is one of the first times that I got silence for advertising my stream. Um... My stream advertisement was in my guild ad. And uh and I got mass reported for my guild advertisement and then they they reported me. I got silenced. Same day. Same day. Same day. Um In Ingrothar. I am Game Master Ingrothar, and I hope you're well today. I'm sorry. It's taken so long to get back to you. We're very busy at the moment, and we're trying to answer as fast as possible. I've overturned your silence, but I suggest you remove the stuff about farts from your spammy guild message and do not spam it anywhere near as much wasn't even spamming it that much but i was kind of but anyway this is this is number two this is this is the second time that they have said something about who cares about like the farts maybe a little too much but my guild name was the starchy farts like, we were the starchy farts like so that's kind of where we're at on the blizzard ban um We'll highlight that later, and I'll try to make a video, and I want to fucking blast it everywhere and be like, yeah, look at this support system Blizzard has. It's so sick. And it's not like I don't have three years of receipts, too. Dog, I got three years of fucking receipts. Oh, uh, let's play some League, I guess. Well, well. Just no tilt in League. The main goal. God damn it, dude. That sucks. And it happens the day after I fucking get banned. No update today after I've hit him with a bunch of, uh... <laughs> a bunch of, uh, logic and, uh, proof. So... My main goal is, uh, I don't think I'm going to get a response till around 5 o'clock, probably. <clears throat> Which I want to grab my laptop so that I have it over here. Um, I want to, I probably won't get a response till, like, 5. <clears throat> it took, like, a, whatchamacallit, uh, like five hours for them to respond to my first ones, <laughs> and I I made the I responded to their ticket at like maybe eleven, but I think it resets the timer every time uh, you uh, every time you submit a new ticket, it refreshes the timer. <laughs> 